In order to become a member of the Freemason fraternity, one must believe in God. It's on this basis that retired Reverend Calvin Abdullah believes the fraternity bears some similarities to the Anglican faith. The Anglican Church, the general membership thereof, has had a, a coming together with the Masonic fraternity on these three areas common to us all. First, belief in God. Secondly, the life of the community under God. And thirdly, the place of tradition in its behavior. Worldwide, there are many persons who have a negative perception of the Freemason fraternity, with several rumors and conspiracy theories put forward by various groups over the centuries. But as District Master Brother Gordon Thavenet noted, Freemasons do in fact have a rule in this society, and each member has a responsibility to show others what the fraternity truly stands for. Because of the economic times that we are experiencing, financial instabilities, a bit of civic unrest, and then added to all of those, the problems that we have with crime. We as Masons must be even more mindful of our role in getting the right example in all that we do. Above all things, the fraternity sought to reinforce its commitment to helping create a society of peace.